Hi, in this video we're going to show you a nice little tool you could use to change your uh, Windows taskbar to look to something kind of old school looking such as Windows XP or Windows Vista. And it will also let you move it to the top or the left or the right, so a lot of people might like that. Uh, we're going to do this on Windows 11, but I have a feeling it should work on Windows 10 as well. So once you download the free uh, file here, it's called RetroBar, you just double click it to run it. And I'll probably give it like a Windows XP look here. And you can see, you know, even if you click on start, it'll still open the Windows 11 uh, start menu in the middle. So to configure it, just right click on any blank area. Uh, you can exit it and then click on properties. So right now it's set to system, X, or system XP. You can kind of look at the different views here. Like so. Say so you want the Windows Vista. And then if you want to show the preview, so let's click OK here first. Right now, if we hover over, we don't get anything. But if we go back to the properties, show Windows previews. Now you get the previews like that. Font smoothing, uh, show the clock, show desktop button, collapse notification icons. You do that if you want it to minimize it. You can customize that to which ones you want to see. So here, if you click on location uh, for the taskbar, right now it's the bottom. We could put it on the top like so. Then you have some advanced options. Automatically start with login. So if you check this box and you log in, you'll notice you'll have your Windows 11 taskbar and it'll kind of do a little thinking then it'll switch to the uh, uh, whatever taskbar you changed it to. Middle click to close taskbar items, rendering, enable debugging, show on multiple displays. You could change the size too if you want to, you know, have it bigger or smaller, give you some more room. But like I said, you click on start, it's going to bring up your uh, regular start menu in the middle here. Just like that. So that's pretty cool. Something to play around with. Uh, so I will put a link in the description where you could download this file and then you could uh, try it out for yourself. And like I said, if you want to go back, just right click, exit, and then you're back to your regular taskbar. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.